Hello, this is Dr. Leo at Lee Time. Rosemary has a long history being used in cosmetics. One of the famous products in the 16th century called uh, Hungary Water, that is the uh, oldest European cosmetics. It's also named uh, Spirits of Rosemary. It is a perfume made from uh, rosemary and lavender. It was used as a refreshing tonics help wash face and rub on the body. Thanks to its antioxidant, anti-inflammation properties, rosemary can help maintain the useful and healthy skin. In this video, I will talk about my best five benefits of rosemary. You can see if your favorite use of rosemary is the same with mine. And there are many ways to use rosemary, such as tea, essential oil, hydrosol, and powder. I will explain how to use the rosemary in order to maximize its benefits. Rosemary, when we use it, the leaves are the major parts because it contains the highest essential oil. And we can use the LT3000 or LT3G to make essential oil and also we can use all of the lead time steel to make its hydrosol. And I have a video demonstrated how to use the lead time steel to make the essential oil and hydrosol from the rosemary leaves. I use the dry leaves because the dry leaves have the higher content of the oil compared with the fresh leaf. But you can also use the fresh leaf. You may not get the same amount of oil by using the dry leaves but you still get a good quality of your products. So now let's talk about uh, my best five benefits of rosemary. The first benefit is anxiolytic. That means it can help reduce stress and depression. There was a study with 100 students participants with age from 20 to 25. They are divided into two groups. The one group has the control they are giving the placebo and the other group are giving the rosemary. At the beginning and at the end of the experiment, the students filled out the questionnaires, testing their stress and depression parameters, sleep quality, prospective and retrospective memory. Rosemary was demonstrated to have a positive effects on enhancing their memory performance, reducing the anxiety and depression. Moreover, the group taking the rosemary reported improved sleep onset latency and increased sleep quality. For taking these benefits, the participants was having the rosemary capsule that is has the dry rosemary leaf powder. It's the same thing. You can either just eat the leaf, the powder, or the capsule. The second benefit is uh, cognition and memory. In England, there was a single factor independent group study having uh, 40 school children students. They are aging from 9 to 11 and uh, divided in two groups. One group are uh, giving the rosemary aroma and the other group has no aroma. The results are promising. They proved the rosemary essential oil can help uh, significantly enhance their working memory in the children. There was another study with grown-ups reporting similar results of improving cognition by using rosemary essential oil. But interestingly, the lavender essential oil lacked the working memory performance compared with the control group. For improving the cognition and the memory, you may consider using the rosemary essential oil in a diffuser. The third benefit is for hair. Rosemary is used in daily skincare as well as the hair care to help nourish hair and add shine. Rosemary essential oil is antimicrobial and it stimulates the blood circulation in the hair follicle. Rosemary essential oil can penetrate the hair follicle and stimulate the hair growth with less side effects. So in order to take the benefits of the rosemary on the hair health, the first way we can add drops of rosemary essential oil in the shampoo 
before we wash our hair and then use a massage oil containing the rosemary oil after the cleaning. And you can also use the rosemary hydrosol as a hairspray to help uh, improve the health of the scalp, uh, reduce dandruff, and uh, keep the hair clean. The fourth one is uh, liver protection. Rosemary essential oil are antioxidants and it mediates its uh, haptoprotective effects also through the activation of a physiological defense mechanisms. In order to take the benefits in this way, you can just simply take a rosemary tea. Add a teaspoon of a dry rosemary leaf into a boiling water and keep it for 10 minutes before you drink it. It's tasty but also containing its antioxidants give the benefits of our body. The fifth one is a natural food preservatives. Rosemary essential oil is one natural food preservatives with a strong antibacteria and antioxidant properties. It can be used to preserve fresh foods such as meat, fish, fruits, and vegetables, and has shown to be significantly superior to the conventional methods by using the chemical preservatives. In this way, the rosemary essential oil is commonly used as a coating on the different food. Besides my top five benefits of the rosemary, rosemary oil is also one of the most popular use in the aromatherapy. It can trace back to 1928. It is believed to have a invigorating, refreshing, stimulating, warming properties and acting as a tonic and boosting our immune system. Rosemary oil can help treat some minor illness like a colic by using the massage oil on the belly. But when we are using the rosemary essential oil, be careful. Even its all natural products doesn't mean it's safe to everybody. There are a couple things you gotta be very careful. First one, never use undiluted rosemary essential oil. You gotta have a good dilution before use. Don't use the pure oil directly. And a second, be careful. Some people may have allergy to the rosemary. So you gotta do the patch test before you're doing the regular use. And a third, keep away from the pregnant. And also for the people with artery hypertension, you gotta be careful in using the rosemary. Thank you for watching. Please let me know how you use rosemary and what benefits you got from it. And this is Dr. Liu at Lee Time. See you next time.